Om Shanti will come back to your own channel. See the soul that truth lies within and Godfather is trying to help us to understand how to earn blessings from other people in today's Vardhan. In the seventh day of a godly Vardhan, Papa wants us to learn the fastest method to move ahead in life, especially in the spiritual life, is to earn other people's blessings. So let's understand what is in the title today. <music> says may you be obstacle proof now how do we remove obstacles in our life we certainly certain times we find people becoming obstacles situations becoming obstacles things becoming obstacles in our life why because we have not earned blessings from people things also and situations too obviously are created by things and people so god says may you be obstacle proof and fly at a fast speed with the rocket of blessings so, to move fast, to be obstacle proof means we have to earn blessings. Let's get it in the explanation part. While having relationships with the mother, father. Mother is Eve, father is Adam or Brahma and Jagat Amba over here. To learn more about who they were and who they are, we'll have to learn the seven days course in which we'll understand who they are actually and how did they live their life, how did they earn blessings. So while having relationships with the mother and father and everyone else, fill yourself with the treasure of blessings and you will never have to work hard to make effort. Just as scientifically, a rocket is the fastest in the same way. Everyday blessings which we are listening to also makes our mind clearer, cleaner, more powerful. So that's one method of moving faster in life. Listening to these blessings on a daily basis, contemplating about them is also the fastest way to move ahead in life. And earning blessings from others is another method also. Just as scientifically a rocket is the fastest, we all know that. In the same way, at the confluence age, now what is this confluence age? There's a confluence between rivers, there's a confluence between weathers, yes, spring, winter, summer, there's a time of transition. So, this is also an age of transition where hell on earth or what we know it as Kali Yuga on earth is also known as hell is transforming into heaven on earth or we can call it as Satya Yuga on earth. More details are there when you do the 7 day course about these different Yugas and now this is the 5th Yuga, the incognito Time. The only time when we souls get a time to transform from impure to pure. And who is the helper in doing that? God, Father himself. So, at the confluence age, the fastest instrument with which to move forward is the most elevated rocket of everyone's blessings. Everybody's blessings for small things. Now, people generally try to earn blessings by donating money, by donating a shelter, by donating food. God says that is there, but that is a limited form of earning blessings. The best way to earn blessings is to help somebody to come out of their issues, whether they're financial, doesn't mean that you start donating, but help them to learn how to earn the righteous way. Relationships, how to mend relationships with his husband, wife, with his brother, sister, with his parent, child relationships, help them to bring about peace and harmony in the relationships. That's another way of earning blessings. So God says, then health-wise also, help them to harmonize their hormones, their mind, their mental state. Why? Because even WHO says that 95% of all the diseases are psychosomatic. So if a person becomes psychosomatically sane and less peaceless, more peaceful, automatically many of the diseases will be avoided and they can get rid of them also. So these are the different ways of earning blessings so one method is you help others to learn meditation share this knowledge with them but before sharing this knowledge one has to learn it first right so God says that you can earn a lot of blessings by helping people out spiritually nowadays so with these no obstacle can touch you even slightly obstacles come from people from things as we have discussed so when we are helping other souls out obviously obstacles won't come from people majority of them 
things when we are meditating for things for five elements or less amount of obstacles will come so god says you will become obstacle proof with these and you will not have to battle with people with situations with health with finances and many more things how do we do that for that we'll have to learn the seven day meditation course and brahma kumaris and learn in depth about this knowledge just by taking out one hour a day for self for god and for peace of mind with this om shanti om shanti